area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Cause your brother don't give a fuck about which one of our check bigger, nigga. What you hurt, slime? Did I catch you at your worst, slime? Hey, big drill! No, don't get quiet now. You should have shut the fuck up the first time. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Click and blend. Follow me on Instagram, Vida underscore fly. Tell your mama I said how I got my guy with me. Showtime, man. Peter, nobody that knows bodies. Check, check, check. Red Breed Entertainment mm -hmm. releases. On YouTube, mm -hmm. can you believe that? Mm -hmm. For you dudes, a battle released on YouTube, mm -mm. Um, the platform. Who? Wait, wait, wait! I got it! I got it! I got it! RBE with the YouTube release. I got three words for you. Do you believe? Do you believe? <laughs> RBE with the YouTube release. Um, quick. Didn't take too long. Hitman Holler vs. Calico comes out. Mm -hmm. um, I did get to peep the battle again. Mm -hmm. I watched it when it happened on the live stream. Mm -hmm. uh, there were so many thoughts that I uh, had from when I originally saw it. Mm -hmm. And then to see it again with no um, direct responsibility, you know, because when so a lot of the times when you watch these battles, people want, mm -hmm. what happened? What happened? What happened? I didn't get to watch it. I didn't get to play. Tell me what happened right mm -hmm. now. And you don't get that opportunity to just directly say, what you thought, you know, you gotta just recap it on the fly. Mm -hmm. You know, from like judging battles and shit like that's why I don't judge battles because I wanna be able to watch it and say how I feel. So like and, to and, the some, game. <laughs> and if something comes later on and I'm like, oh man, I didn't catch this, I didn't catch that. I don't like dealing with people's careers and shit like that, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? And then I judge a battle and it didn't go the way I thought it was gonna go mm -hmm. and I watch it again. I'm like, damn, what was you know I thinking? What? Yeah, so for me I'm good on that. I like to just talk my shit, you know what I'm saying? Um, on my own camera, and then because it's unofficial. Like mm -hmm. what I say here is not official. If I say a motherfucker lost the battle, so what? Nah, but, uh, nah. They listen. They this don't count. They look at us this as the count. definitive. This you feel count. me? They this look at us. Uh, if Vada Fly and Showtime SP said you won or lost, it's a count for you to win or lose. That's what the fans say. I'm just. I'm not saying that's what they say. We just fans at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. Me being a judge myself, there is a criteria that we follow. Mm -hmm. And so I follow the criteria. And in the criteria, that's how it depends whether you won or you lost. I don't care about the second playback. But this battle, I needed, I, I, I knew what I had. I knew who I had as a winner the first time. Mm -hmm. And I felt as though that the world also agreed with me. Mm -hmm. Come to find out it ain't that. Mm -hmm. You know, first it was the it was the it was the Mooka Knights. Then it's the Cassidians. Mm -hmm. Now it's the Calico. Mm -hmm. That's that. Cause Calico fans. You be hating on Calico. Nah, whatever. That shit, that's man. You not be hating hate. on Cal, it's man. Not like hate. you be hating on Cal so much that that it be coming back like the next three days. Like I seen a nigga, bro. I said, I don't know who it was. This nigga made a whole video for real and took what well, you said and then took him wilding in a battle, put all that shit together. Put it on Twitter, mm -hmm. made sure he tagged Calico so he saw it, yeah. and then retweet. I saw it on my timeline. I said, damn, son, you hate, you be hitting on this. Let me tell you something, okay? Person who tagged me and sent that, because I don't even remember who, who no, the name was. No, no. But Irrelevant Ellison. The bad of the, ooh, Irrelevant Ellison is your name now. Change it now. Irrelevant Ellison posted Calico versus Tay Rock. And That's the same posted, battle. He only posted certain clips, though. He posted, like... Six bars where he got crazy reaction, then another two bars where he got crazy reaction, then another two. I was like, this this is a highlight reel. Anybody can show. If I go to the gym right now and take 500 shots, but I make seven of them. What? And I'm clipping I can post all the words that I made. It's going to make it look like I'm one of them ones. Oh, no. it's, 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 like, the same, it's the same thing. And then if you want to do it, at least pick a battle where Calico clearly wins. Cause I'm wearing the bitches. He said, he said, where were the? He said, he said hey, yeah. anyway. Moving on. Let's go. I'ma I'm say. I'ma say. I'm, I'm not hate. hate. I'm not hate. I'm just only saying, due to the significant events that have occurred, right? Some things have not been fallen, in my opinion, of Calico's favor. When Calico did the diss track with the WWF diss track, he sh did he shake up the world? No, like I don't think that it wasn't that memorable. But when we talked about it, I sounded like I was hating, right? It was. When it when 
<laughs> when Calico, uh, uh, who did Calico battle uh, before Hitman? Um, it was Calico versus, uh, was it Twerk? I think it was Twerk. Was a little minute ago. It was it was before that, but it don't matter. It was one. It was another battle where Calico was no uh, the, uh no that's the same. Verb, 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 yeah. So verb. yeah, so you feel that way. I what? don't. So you hate you be hating, my nigga. That's just, but it's, I guess because there are certain things that when Calico raps, it's he goes by uh uh his 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 um his slogan is there's a difference between metaphors and real rap. Yeah. Which means to me that you would rather have a bunch of real rap instead of your metaphors. Mm -hmm. If you try a metaphor though, make it good. Nah, <laughs> man, he had on. The, I pulled up the stats because I be having to pull up stats, mm -hmm. dog. On the URL app, mm -hmm. Calico versus Verb, mm -hmm. he beat him all three rounds, and the votes is 1,700 to 660. Calico clearly won. No hate. It's fine. Let's go. I have a choice, but this one, you can't vote for. Calico versus Hitman. Right. Off the rip, Calico jumps out, and I like it. Like I said, I'm going to show y'all that I wrote this down. Go ahead and try to find the lyrics. Mm -hmm. You're not going to find it. Okay. You got to watch it. Let me work. He says, I've been lying to you since you've been lying to me. Mm -hmm. That's slick talk right there. I've been lying to you since you've been lying to me. Just think about that though. Landslide. I got some shit that could slide land. Like Uncle Snoop was going to say, God damn. Crowd was going crazy for that. Like, mm -hmm. all right, that was right. That was cool. Okay. On, My new gun is like some shit Tesla would make. Now he in Idaho. What that mean? A vegetable state. I'm right. On you. I'm on you. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool, all right? All right, I just want to see your reactions to this. He says, you know niggas be playing both sides like Donnie Brasco? Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Let me give you a skate, man. Let me give you a skate. He says, they gonna have his body on say cheese. So I told the gunman to leave the flash on. They thought, of, they think he a rough rider. Catch him around Eve. Take the knife carver X in his back and watch him drag on to court and get a silent treatment and get back home. Mm-hmm. I like it too. You know what say cheese is? Yeah, I know what say cheese is. Okay, okay, say cheese. And then after that, they think he a rough rider. Catch him around Eve. I guess the evening. Mm-hmm. Even in the evening. Uh, take the knife carver X on his back. Then watch him drag on the court. Get a silent treatment and get back home. I don't know. Okay. I, I, you know, sometimes I be needing help to understand it. I just... Right, right. Okay. You the type of nigga to be on the internet dialing your brother knowing I was supposed to be in, knowing you were supposed to be his backbone. I'm the type of nigga supporting complete complete strangers as long as they black owned. That we nothing like I, that was fire. That was fire. Fire. Till I realized what does that really mean? I'm just saying you. It means a lot. Okay. It Let, means a lot. Okay. You the type of nigga on the internet dialing your brother knowing I was supposed to be his, knowing you were supposed to be his backbone. Meaning you out here, but I would never disrespect yeah. you on the internet because uh -huh. you my brother, right? Uh -huh. But he says, I'm the type of nigga supporting complete strangers as long as they black on. Mm -hmm. He's saying we're nothing alike. Right. Like you the type that would go to this extreme and I'm doing this. That means we're nothing alike. Right. I'm, I'm rocking with cool. you. Cool. You far from a street nigga. A scholar boy, if any. You ain't gonna spin Mac 10s and choppers popping out the Hemi. Two shots, Dr. Sum, then like Tupac, blink twice, holla, if you hear me. Who shot you? That was hot. Now that was hot, okay? Cause two shots, Doctor's gonna be sounding like Tupac. Blink twice, holla, hit man, mm -hmm. if you hear me. Come on, that's it. I was feeling that. Tapped, he said, tapped in with my Cali niggas last week. He was thinking, uh, he was thinking, sweet. They done, uh, they done took the presidential rollie from him. And got him in peace. That was funny as hell. Fire! It was fire. I like it. He says, how you retire for a week? Briz been gone for a year. Retiring for the week. I like, and then let me, let me, let me specify this. I like the way that Calico raps. Mm-hmm. When he's not doing the metaphors, okay. Because the ones that I like, I said that 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 Eve Rough Rider scheme, I did not like that at all. Because it, it to me, it felt like it felt like Mook, where you're doing a lot of the word association, but it kind of don't have a point to it. You know what I'm saying? That's just that was me nitpicking the bars. Right. But when you catch me with shit like I've been lying to you since you've been lying to, since you've been lying to me, right. I like that wordplay. Uh -huh. I like the uh, what's the joint? He said uh, uh, they done took the presidential rolly on him. They Nigga got, got MP. It's it. That, Cal, keep that energy. I like that. Don't go out the window trying to do, 
trying to do the, the scheming. It, it's that's not for you because you got to be the difference between metaphors and real rap. Right. Now, round one on Hitman. With Hitman, we know it's all performance, right? We know with Hitman, you might get a couple of lines from Hitman, right? Okay. Let me give you the. He says, I had plans on chilling and letting the summer pass, but he offered me a number so high that it gave me flashbacks. Now I'm running to get another bag. Okay. He offered me a number so high that it gave me flashbacks. Now I'm going running back to get another bag. Mm -hmm. Ain't that dope? Yeah. That was also a large case. You forgot when Smack wasn't paying for your hotels. My brother slept in the bed with me and we made pallets on the floor for you. Mercedes told me it was 195000 to get that Benz off the showroom floor. And what I did. Guess what I did? Got that motherfucking Benz off the showroom floor. And now they got me battling a nigga I used to have to wake up off a showroom floor. That was fire. Same word association type style. And to me, I like that. But let me not do that. But let me, he got a bigger reaction off of that. And I'm like, oh, that, that's, that's fire to me. Right? Continue it on. So don't question what they paying me. Why these niggas keep playing me? My little brother said you gotta show them you in a different class. I said I did. That's why I left a lot in the AMG. Cause the AMG is not even, cause usually for Mercedes they come in. Different classes, right? Yeah, uh, yeah I got you. Okay, but do we, I don't expect Holla to be doing this though. Like I expect him to be all performance. Okay. All right. He says, I catch you at Big T in slow traffic. Hop out, scope action. Walk up, set tripping in remote fashion. Any mixed signals, a tenant be on top of TV. He don't want no static. That was fine. And I tried to say it by not trying to say it. Like, that's even, I'm trying to reach check it. And it makes sense. A tenant be, a ten, a tenant. Uh, yeah, a tenant be on top of TV. A tenant is on top of TV. A Y'all thinking, why swing when I got this tray for Bo Jackson? Bo Jackson. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. Uh, this is real life, not a quiz or test, but I can end up in a crowd with it. Mm -hmm. Talk that Malice in the Palace shit. By the way, Malice in the Palace is on Netflix. That's no free promo. I just actually wanted to see that because it was actually, that was actually that's a good documentary. Really I saw good. it twice. So really let's good. keep going. <laughs> Yo, watch it, man. You so mad. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it no, was no. mad. I'm done talking. Oh, and uh, Steve McMahon? Never mind. Uh, he goes, um, uh, uh, your pop's here, but I'm sunning him. You know how to humble a nigga that's extra? Put the guy with the leading role in front of him? Mm -hmm. Uh, 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 ooh. Man, I, this, I got all this from the first round? Damn. Um, he said, I can't believe I'm giving him attention. I should be somewhere tropical. This done got personal, so I'm going to stand over top of you because it's... it's Mm -hmm. Okay, he says when you when I call him lacking, I wasn't even thinking logical. I'm putting the scope on Calico, but Calico on the scope is that even possible? Yeah, that was fine. To me, to me already, I got I got Hitman winning that round. But let's do it. I'm a over when he even when he got to that part, he says no. I'm on, I'm four fifteen minutes in. I'm four fifteen minutes in. I'm a overkill him. Family ain't, family can't grieve because they don't even know it's the. Mm -hmm. You wrote a check, your ass can't cash, and it's expensive. Every nigga I'm withdraw, you know the interest? Fire. Uh, oh, yeah. And then the, 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 the biggest line at the end of the round was, all that tough shit, uh, all that tough shit you be on, none of my niggas play that. I made a million dollars off battle rap. Can't none mm -hmm. of y'all niggas say that. I like that. Um, Who got the first? Well, well, I mean, I got a winner of the first. I did, like... The line, I don't know if it was in Calico's first round. I don't know if you, uh, you it probably was. Oh, no way. He's like, uh, you, you want to battle with me all because Cass whooped your ass in the street? I thought that shit was fire. You know what I'm saying? Like, I definitely like that line. Because it was like, because and it was kind of almost true because you never see Hitman battle two, two months times, after. Two months yeah, like, that's a good, that's, that's a good point. All right. That was a very good yep. point he made because he want, what it seemed like is because a lot of the fans Mm -hmm. Gave Cassidy the win, whether he won or not. Right. You know, it kind of seemed like he wanted to take another battle to get that one behind him. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But um, I do have Hitman Follow winning the first round. Mm -hmm. And I got him winning the first round kind of clearly, too. Mm -hmm. I felt like his material was better. Um, I felt like uh, while Calico had some moments mm -hmm. in the overall uh, dialogue of the first round, I just had Cal Hitman's material was better. I liked this round better. So yeah. I had Hitman winning the first. I agree. Now, this is the round that. Is the this is the round that needs to be debated? So with that, because they're gonna say, yo, while you was giving a lot, you was doing a lot more lines for Hitman than y'all was for Calico. Don't worry, 
I got you. He says, I'm the irrelevant who ended up being more relevant than the relevant. Mm -hmm. It's evident. I planted my own lane and set precedent. Mm -hmm. Made diss songs and diss y'all on the regular. I am a wizard. I use telekinetic powers to pay your bills ahead of schedule. Mm. Okay, um, you use telekinetic powers to pay the bills ahead of schedule. Okay, cool. This is a this is the line that I like. Once again, you doing a lot of the rapping, and it's to me it's not I I, I like it, but the lines that I'm catching are the ones that you not highlight. He goes, this is a business where niggas could kill less about your feelings. That's why this battle makes sense mm -hmm. because the whole angle between them, oh, is this personal, is this personal? I love you, Holla, like you're my mans. Mm -hmm. But yet you're making it seem like I don't like you. You forget this is business where right. niggas don't care about you. I'm only here for this bag. And I that is a highlight for that line. But he said that you sat on a lie back in like my mom before she come on her menstrual. Bitch, is this city? Bitch, is you serious? What, you want some chocolate, bitch? You want your period? Crowd was going crazy for that. Why? Um... <laughs> Cause I know if I say that right, never mind. Um, he said, "You raising your son like you ain't been raised by real niggas." This, Fire. Is, this is this is Fire. this is the one. This is the one. Mm -hmm. He said, "You raising your son like you ain't been raised by real niggas." Cause the goal is to keep the kids out of harm's way with real niggas. Mm -hmm. You out punching drunk niggas in the face in the, while you in the field with them, Talk. like that avoidable situation could have ended up you being killed with them. Mm -hmm. So real. That's the shit I like. If it's it, it, there, no metaphors in that. That was real rap. He says, if Big Gerald was, if Big Gerald was there, he probably would have shook his hand and took a pic with him. Talking about, yeah, you exposing your child to some shit that they don't really need to be exposed to with the drunk dude, and then you had him filming it. Mm -hmm. That shit was crazy, son. Mm -hmm. That shit was wild. That's crazy, right? We gonna get to that. Uh, he says, why you out here clout chasing when you the only nigga, he said, when you the only nigga, shots ring and put him down like a house payment. That's a line I'll keep. He says, got a thousand beans, but can't move because the route dangerous. Number one pick, don't give a fuck what the scout saying. <laughs> Wasn't you a wide receiver? I'm on the road, bitch. The route ran. I popped up in the A like. With the what? South pain. Talk to him. That's the. No metaphors. Just give me that real rap and I'm with you. Now. Uh, but I did, I did like the his shots rang and put him down like a house payment. It, it, to me, it was quick. Right there, and plus, you know, we at that stage in like where we need to be putting down on house payments. He says, I'm glad them niggas robbed you for that incredible chain. That bitch was weak as fuck. I liked it, but at the same time, I only liked it at the end of that. Here he goes, all that fake ass power only getting them extorted for his per diem. This is this is the this the haymaker around. He says, um, when you he said, when he land, LA niggas be happy when they see him. They know he be Finger licking, got him, paying for security, robbing him when they with him. Mm. So, he's so not a street nigga, he don't even realize the shit he doing is really stunting for niggas. Talking about big watch, he, then he's talking about wherever they was at, yeah, the streets or something. He said talking about big watch, big chains on the is nigga, it Christmas? 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 Yeah, yeah, that was crazy. Fire. He's talking to that man, not fire, he's getting talked He's to. He, and he was saying he don't rap like that. He he don't do it like like he's in all in between. Mm -hmm. He's like he's talking to him. Right. And then and then you can see where uh, Hitman's entourage starts talking. He's like, "Yo, shut up! You gonna get some fame? Also, you gonna get some fame? Yep. And also in that he's same like, round, like, he said, "Them niggas right you here." Yeah, mm -hmm. he's like, shut up, worker. Your boss, my man. Mm -hmm. Like he's like your boss, my man. Yep. And he's like, oh, and then he freestyle. That was a freestyle moment when he said, "Them niggas that jumped you." They here? They ain't here right now. Yeah, he said. Like, he like, said they would have never. Yeah, he's like, he's like talking about if my man would have did like, this. Like, and came like, down like, like the first time y'all niggas ever showed me y'all was about that shit. Because mm -hmm. the niggas that jumped me pulled up to my battle, they wouldn't be able to walk out that, that bitch. bitch. That's a freestyle right there. Did the incident occur before or before, after the battle? Before, before. So that what? Yes. So two more points for Calico. That shit was fire. That man. shit was fire. Second round is the one that I'm with y'all. Cause in this round it wasn't no metaphors. It was just real rap, and I like that shit. Right. But it, Hitman also gotta back it up. Now, he said, uh, uh, second round on Hitman, he goes, "You," he said, "Us not being cool, you want my career to fall off. You know that would happen." He said, uh, "You thought that would happen. You looking at the nigga that laid the blueprint for battle rappers to be successful outside of battle rapping? Mm -hmm. Is that not real?" 
All right. He says, you got a little boy mentality. Never took your brand serious. That's why you was never the most paid dude. Because you'd rather waste the talent and go to the streets and take some risks. Your pops had to take to raise you. Mm -hmm. Nigga, who raised you? Fire. So, going back from Calico round, Calico trying to check him on, uh, on something that Hitman did with his son right there. When Hitman is talking about the shit that you did, when you taking the same risk your pop was doing when he was trying to... Mm-hmm. I like it. Whew. I was like, I said, because I try to find things to be like, all right, well, that could kind of cancel each other out. With the Halloween mm -hmm. Nitty, I found out that Bennett and the Nigel cancel them out. Mm -hmm. This one here is the who raised you versus who raised you. Cancel them out. On some Midwest shit, I was Jordan. Ain't nothing wrong with being Pippin. But you rather team up with the, with the, you rather team up with the nigga that do podcasts with a nigga that pistol whipped him. Mm -hmm. Is that real? Family singing, pick up and kill it while... Okay. Why not? Mm. Tickets that I gave him. Now, maybe this is just me being a judge, mm -hmm. but there is that thing where you know y'all gonna have to Minnesota loop me. But I don't like it when a nigga be talking through my round. Like I don't like if the other person is rapping. Don't talk through the rounds. Calico was doing a lot of that in the second round. Talk. That was fire. You lying, bro? Chill. Nigga, what? I, I hate that. I, I don't need ad libs from you. Because every time Hitman, every time Calico rap, Hitman was doing this, he was like, he was just listening. I just don't like, I don't prefer that. So it kind of. It does nothing for me. It, I, 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 I don't like that. I don't care. I don't, I don't, I don't like I don't that care. shit. He says, Kyrie, don't call me nigga. That was cool. It was all right. But he says, I'm just showing y'all the difference between. Now, oh, he also, Hitman was also explaining. Uh, how many people, uh, he do PayPal's and he do cash apps and stuff for the college students and things like that. And when it comes through, uh, uh, when it's around Christmas time, he's like, we was giving out more toys than Santa. And then the crowd was like, oh, what are you talking about? He's like, listen, I'm just showing y'all the difference between metaphors and real rap. And then real rap and your metaphors is still whack. Mm. Banana clips, let Cal see them and peel back. Mm -hmm. And whatever's still hanging, reload and peel that. Mm. Banana clips, calcium. It's about to get dark for you. I mean, real black. If I swing, you gon' need pe you gon' need ice packs. We're ill at. Fuck around and get a knot this big. We're bill at. You gon' need a sensu bean to heal at. See, a sensu bean in Dragon Ball Z is what they need to regain the health of power. So they was almost close to death, and Krillin always came up, take the sensu bean, and that's why I brought him back to life. I like that bar. Mm -hmm. Now, the second round can be debated. If you feel as though Calico was being way more realer. That's great. I got Calico winners there. That's round. fine. Me personally, I kind of got Hitman on that because he gave you. He get uh, my thing was I like the fact that he was giving you the realness and then made the personal, but he still had a hot line to go with it. And then after he did all of that personals, he ended the round with bars. Okay. Versus difference between metaphor. You get what I'm saying? Like that's just it, personal preference, right? I had Hitman 2-0. And then when they said how you calling it in the third round. If y'all peep it, in the third round, you see people going 1-1 one, one on the stage. You see people going 1-1 one, one in the crowd. You see a couple people going 2-0. Oh, two I had a 1-1 going to the third. Nobody yes. said Cal 2-0. Oh, but you can have a 1-1 one, one going to the third. And I think I tweeted it saying I had a 1-1 one, one going into the third. Now, third round, Calico. He goes, that alone, oh, oh yeah, he said, you said there's a difference between metaphors and real rap. He said, shoot, y'all gonna say I ain't, I ain't a legend. Nigga, I'm God tier. Mm -hmm. Right? Crowd went crazy for that. I was like, okay, dude. Yeah, you got to. That he said, you saying that line on Summer Man is that alone make me legendary. He says, you get in these interviews and cut off the inner you. Ain't uh, is, uh, you ain't tripping. Uh, I done seen you performing your raps, nigga. You scripted. Mm -hmm. I said, I did. He said, I said you be acting like a lame sometimes. Never said you couldn't rap. You gifted. But I ain't finna be boot, boot licking. Uh, I ain't finna to be, be boots to be in cahoots. Yeah, with yeah, you. yeah. Talk to him. I like that shit too. Yeah. He like the oversee niggas, so I'ma walk to the roof with you. How you keep a ham sandwich nigga in line? You toothpick him. Mm -hmm. No, don't scratch your head. When you have fucking ham sandwich at the job, they keep them in line with a toothpick. It's not the craziest line to you, but it does make sense. Let's cool. keep going. All right. Yeah, now, what's the what's the joint? What's the joint? We was oh, by the way, uh, Hitman Holler's girlfriend's name is uh, Cinnamon. Mm -hmm. So you know you'll hear him say a lot of sins or take sin. I'll take sin away. away. Mm -hmm. So he says I'll baptize Holler, then I'm gonna take his sins away. Fire. Right. Fire. Here is the part that I put the scope on. 
You know Tay Rock, uh, he said, you ever seen a big booty bitch walking down the street? <laughs> yeah, the ratchet got a switch. Yeah. You know Tay Rock girlfriend? You know how to, yep, yep. When you watch that battle again, just pay attention to the nigga on the left. I don't, I don't think he was listening. I just, matter of fact, pause it. Go to that part of the battle and then come back. What was he doing? That's all, I just, I just needed to know that. You gonna have to get your mans, cause I don't know what that was. He says, now, and then the ending line. The ending line of Calico's third. Hey, Big Gerald. <laughs> no, you should have f up the first time, right? Mm -hmm. Now, on the video, there was silence. Mm -hmm. But I recall there was a girl or there was somebody in the crowd that said, yes, sir. And she kind of messed up the vibe. I don't like the fact that y'all WWE audio cut that joint out. I don't okay? but I would, I, hey, you talking about it, so yeah. it, that's why I did it. I'm just saying, because I just did because I remember that happening and she messed up the vibe. Now, granted, when it was happening, Calico was doing great. He was cooking, but when she did that, I was like, oh man, she kind of just messed up the whole vibe, kind of threw it off. But if you watch the battle on YouTube, that don't happen. So we can kind of like not count it or cancel it out. Calico was going off in his third, which was great. Hitman also had to rap. And he says, this is for you. I am real life sick of you. You went and made friends with other rappers that don't like me. That's the same thing bitches do. Mm -hmm. um, then he did the, uh, the Ali with the talking, Tyson with the walking, I'm Floyd with the money, I'm Wilder with the balking, I'm Shane with the women, Canelo with the sparring, I knocked him out cold, it's Hitman in front of Martin. Not Marvin Hagler, but Martin, like, Tommy the Hitman Harry for it. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, he said, I'm sugar with the jabbing. Get a nigga off me. Rap like Holy Field. He said, Rap like Roy, because y'all must have forgot. Holy Field with the Baldy. Cool. He also do, uh, he said, See, my homie said, Don't do that scheme. They ain't really care for it. Why you say Tyson and Holy Field? Because I figured they ain't had an air for it. Mm -hmm. It was one of them things where it's like, Okay, Hitman got the first. You definitely, you can say that Calico got that third. The second is where it's debatable. The second is where you, pr you do your preferences. Right. So, I personally got Hitman doing the first two rounds, and I got Calico clearly taking the third. And then uh, Calico and Hitman had the, his brother jumping in in the third round. I didn't saying, like that. You know what I'm saying? I didn't like that. I ain't Briz or some shit like I that. I didn't like that. Uh, I, had, I had Calico winning the second and third round. That's fine. Um, Calico, I felt his third round was better, mm -hmm. and I felt the second round was better. And I watched the battle more than once, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? In the beginning, when I first seen it, it was kind of debatable, but after I watched it again, I kind of I kind of went uh, Calico two, two. That's fine. Two last two rounds clicked. That's you know what all. I'm fine. Uh, <laughs> you know, uh, we can we can 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 we split the decision? Is that what that is? Can we? It's split. Like what y'all want me? To, what y'all want me to do? Oh, he's a hitman fan. No, it's not that I'm a hitman fan. I'm listening to certain things, and I'm there's certain. Everybody is different, so that's the reason why preference is is such a key thing because you got somebody who prefers to hear all of Head Ice's real rounds, mm -hmm. and then that same then there'll be a different person that'll tell you that Head Ice is not good because all he does is just have those real rounds. He's not saying anything. You get what I'm saying? There are people who have specific people that they like and that they prefer. Me personally, I was more so impressed with Hitman actually doing more than performing, actually having lines, getting personal, and also trying to real talk Calico because that's what Calico's the most known for. Mm -hmm. I was impressed with Hitman that way. Yeah, yeah, and I was impressed with Calico because he had like those solid moments and he was talking to him about certain things that was personal, like really getting at him about the shit with the son. Mm -hmm. And then, you know what I'm saying? Like he was really like talking to him. And I liked his third round too, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. he, 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 he had some shit in there. Like it was, it was definitely, it's a dope battle overall though, you know what I'm saying? Like they both got busy and, you know, it's really no wrong decision, but, no. you know, I just went with uh, Cal 2 1, you know what I'm saying? I so. got Hitman 2 1. Respectfully, I, I I like that. I like that. But other than that, you already know what it is. Game. Okay.